The search for two 14-year-old twin sisters ends in a local hotel. Tonight, we're getting a look at the moment police found them in a room with two adult men. We're glad you're with us for Local 4 News at 6. I'm Devin Skillian. I'm Karen Drew in for Kimberly Gill. These two young girls had been missing for more than a month from their Detroit home. And that ended when police were called to the Comfort Inn in Allen Park, and a sharp-eyed officer recognized the twins. Mara McDonald live tonight. Mara, police have taken a man in his 30s, I guess, into custody, correct? Devin, they sure have. And police are still trying to unravel how these girls ended up here at this Comfort Inn and exactly where they have been for an entire month. Allen Park police had their body cams rolling when they discovered the girls inside a motel room with two men in their 30s. I know who you guys are. Okay. And I know who's looking for you. The girls left their home in Detroit on March 8th willingly. This is the second time they've run away. You don't know, so stop acting like you do. Okay. They didn't want to leave the men they were there with in the motel, men who are old enough to know that keeping two missing 14-year-olds in a room is illegal. Police took one of them described as a man in his 30s into custody for harboring missing children as well as fraud. The credit card used to book their motel room was stolen. Now, how the girls ended up with this man is now what's under investigation. Was this Get sex trafficking or something else? My dad. Back here live, and the question then becomes, did they meet this man or and his friend, this man and his friend online? Was this somebody they somehow got to know peripherally through friends? It's all unclear. I will tell you that Allen Park police have the man that you peripherally see on that video in custody. They're trying to get to the bottom of it, but that the initial thought is that this was indeed an attempt at sex trafficking. We're live in Allen Park tonight. I'm Mara McDonald, Local 4. Man, okay. All right, Mara, we'll continue to follow the fallout.